In this video I'll show you how to do a disk cleanup on Windows 10. To do this, if you go down to the search bar at the bottom, uh, Cortana, and click on that, and then type in uh, disk cleanup, like so, and disk cleanup will appear right at the top, and if you click on that, um, you then select the drive, which is usually set to the lo local disk C by default. Just press OK, and begin to search your computer for uh, files. This might take a little while depending on um, how many files you have. So we're just going to wait for that. Okay, in the next box, um, you get a list of items here which you can uh, check by ticking the boxes like so. I usually tick all, uh, tick all of them. Um, but we'll go through some of the stuff here. Um, as you can see, this one here is relatively small. We have one, uh, the setup log files, which are only taking up 28.9 KB. Well, KB is very, very small, so it's not really necessary to delete that. Um, this one here, which is the temporary internet files, is 386 MB. MB is bigger than KB. Um, that one might be worth getting rid of. It's not, you know, it's not overly massive, but uh, um, it still takes up a little bit of room there. Um, if you see anything with uh, GB, which is gigabytes, um, that's higher than MB and KB, um, you definitely want to look at getting rid of that. So um, if you want to know what each one of these things are, you just uh, click on one and down the bottom here it comes with the description. Um, usually it's okay to check every single one of these. Uh, the recycle bin, you might have stuff in the recycle bin, so you might want to check that first just in case uh, there's stuff that you accidentally put into there um, that you might not want to delete. So go through every single one of these, uh, make sure you want to delete them. Um, it's perfectly safe to have them checked. Um, and down here, I'll, uh, it says about uh, total amount of disk space you gain. So uh, ticking all these boxes, I'll gain 594 MB, which is not a great deal. Um, but on yours it might be a lot more. So if you're ready to proceed, just press OK and then it will ask you to confirm. Um, so we just press delete files and it will go through the process of deleting them files for you. Um, this might take a little while depending on how many files it's got to delete. When it completes, you won't get a notification, it will just simply vanish. And that is how you uh, do a disk cleanup on Windows 10. Thanks for watching.